on nine planets based on that our astrology also working based on that our life also working and everything is connected with this sun nine nine planets first we'll start to understand what is the planet this is planet a means wandering wandering means they are keep on wandering here they are moving means wandering or moving a star it is called planets which are not moving they are called simple stars which are wandering they are moving if you will just change the reference of the measurement then everything is moving but based on the our reference if whatever is moving then it, which we can measure then we are telling it is a planets if we'll see then nine planets are just i have written from the distance from the sun if sun is here then uh, first will come mercury second will come venus third will come earth fourth will come mars that sequence many of the times it will be useful in your gs then is jupiter it is easy just to fit in mind nothing is there mercury is the smallest they are very near after then venus is there then earth is earth is at third number next to the earth all what people are doing they are doing the all war and world war who is the god of war mars roman god god of war mars next is coming once after you, you can say long duration of war all will become ecumen or all will become wisdom person like europe now their war is not there all nations are equally capable means power balance power balance means war will not happen means it, you will get the wisdom jupiter next is coming saturn after then uranus and neptune side of planet rahu and ketu we are living in vedic astrology but uh, this is not you can say solid planet it is side of planet excluding earth nine planets you you can count it is a six seven eight this is nine ten then you will exclude the earth then you will find nine planets and based on this movement of nine planets their time duration of the revolution and rotation we will get the different different type of impacts on human being apart from that we have one more thing which are affecting much on the living and living thing on the earth that is moon because moon is very nearer to the earth next will come to the mercury that is just will take basic definition how they have derived first planet is mercury that is roman mythology messenger of god cuc planet and mercury is affecting your neuro system and very less if you will see the complete cycle of revolution of the mercury then you can say very less number less uh, number of days mercury will be in very you can say exact very uh, you can say powerful condition means by that also you can understand very probability is there very less percentage people are there they are getting very high quality of neuron or neuron movement if merc your mercury is bad the neuron movement will be bad means you will not able you will not able to use your brain properly your memory power will be not good your logic logic will be not good messenger of god venus that is roman mythology goddess of love who are having good venus they will have good looking due to most of the girls their venus must be good then only their life will be better say. then goddess of love or uh, you can say greek another god is there aphrodite then world related to aphrodite also will be related to go related to love or related to venus but roman mythology it is a goddess of love and marriage earth this world this illusion distinguished from heaven and hell mars god of war that is roman mythology father of romulus and remus or you can say greek mythology sometimes it is called this world mars you can say this is god of war and roman mythology he was the one of the prominent god because that time continuous war was happening among different different type of people or different different type of uh, belief system next is coming jupiter roman god it is a king and ruler of olympian god if you are seeing hollywood movies then many of the movies has made up based on that olympian god titans iron many of the movies you will find if you are not seeing try to see it many of the knowledge you will get get it classical knowledge that is classics of the world these all based on the our roman philosophy and you can say uh, greek philosophy saturn it is a roman god of agriculture greek again we are telling it is a cronus 
means related to Kronos also, whatever words will be derived that will be related to agriculture. Uranus, ruler of a sky, overthrown by his son Kronos, okay, father of Titan. Father of Titan was Uranus and he was overthrown by Kronos. Who was Kronos? Saturn. Now you are getting connection. Now you are getting the connection. Neptune, Roman god of sea. It is the last planet due to be a Roman god of 